Alright, so you wanna make silver. Who doesn't, am I right? You've seen a lot of guides on YouTube. I'm sure that there's like hundreds of thousands of guides and they all work. That's the thing. Everything works. In this game, it's a free economy. You can do whatever. You can literally make silver gathering rabbit hide. <laughs> like tier 1 rabbits or tier 2, whatever tier those are. You, you know what I mean. You can be doing everything in this game to make silver. But you don't like doing anything. Maybe maybe you like me. Maybe you don't enjoy the full loot aspect. You, you, you don't really want to adventure into this side of the map. Because, you know, it's kind of scary. Like, it, groups are made... Uh, people control maps, it's kind of hard to get into it if you're not joining one of them. And you might not be wanting to join one of them. You might be exactly like me, a solo player. So what you do in that situation? Well, th there's Corrupted, but uh, then you might lose your gear. There's some Hellgates, but then uh, you have to do it in a group. So what are you left with as, a, as mostly a solo player, let's say? What, what, what are your options? That was my concern as well. The best thing I found, for me, personally, which easily pays for my premium and uh, gives me a lot of spare silver, is this. You go into any city, uh, just decide which city you like the most because you're not obligated to stick with your choice, but you should. Like, Because <laughs> as far as I know, you lose your rank. I, I will explain. Like, Try to pick a city and try to stick with it. You probably already have a favorite city, so just go with it. Every city is about as powerful, so, uh, like, it's not a big difference. Like, come on, it's really not a big difference. And they all, um, uh, like, fluctuate every time. So what you do, you go into a city, let's say I'm in Limhurst, and you look for this guy in Limhurst, this guy in Fort Sterling, this map in Tedford, this guy in Matlock, this guy in Bridgewatch. And what you do, when you reach that guy, uh, it will ask you to enlist. You will have to do that. It's the same as this. Like it's Instead of saying flag, it says enlist. Just, just click it. It will explain it to you everything you need to know. Flag up. Are you sure you want to flag for the city? Yes. And this thing appear by your name. This, is, this like shows the rank you have. Like There's a bunch of ranks. You don't need to worry about it. Get yourself a healer build. The build I'm using right now is the one I recommend the most if you enjoy healing. But genuinely, you could be running with a fishing rod. Like, as long as you can hit people, which I don't think you can with a fishing rod, but you got the point, you'll be good. Like, just, <laughs> it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. It's good if you have an AoE-oriented build, because then you can tag a little more. But this thing is not really focused on tagging. Like, all right, I do get a bunch of points by tagging people, but that's not the main source of my points, so you don't even have to worry about that. And what you do after you are enlisted, and after you got your build going, by the way, let me show you the build just in case you want to try the same thing. Just so, you know, this is really not needed, but I like to have it. Oh, this is very important. Uh, I suggest you, sh you should get some resistance pots, but you don't need to. You don't need to get, you could be running butt naked with a fishing rod. If you can hit with a fishing rod, I'm not sure if you can. But you got the point. Like, you, you don't need to wear anything, genuinely. Like, the only reason you're wearing things is for your survivability. Because the longer you survive, not only that, the more fun you're going to have, but the more silver you're going to make. And what you do afterwards, in whatever city you are, so in my case right now, it's Limhurst, you look on the map, and you see this. Boom. Those are, like, if you look, you see your city flag in the regions that your city controls. And sometimes your city is a little brave. See? Like right here. And it pushes other city territories. If you were to look at the faction warfare map, you see, like, we are pushing a little bit into Bridgewatch. So is Martlock. I guess everybody hates sand people. <laughs> it's not only me, see, guys? Um, and look at this. You see that one of, a, one of your outposts, as you see the color green, is under attack by... Probably the sand people. Like, you cannot really tell who's attacking, but I would guess Fort Sterling is not traveling from there just to attack this outpost. So I, I would guess it's Bridgewatch. Oh, and you see it's a big attack, because they only they just capture that. Sometimes, uh, there's the opposite situation happening. So you see a flag of the enemy being under attack. In that situation, you can confidently say, especially if it's close to your faction city, that your faction is attacking their city. 
So just go there and join them. By the time you reach them, they might already capture the specific outpost, but you're still going to be part of the fight. So it's still going to be fun and you're still going to be making points. And that is pretty much what you do. In the following clips, you'll see me just do exactly what I told you. And you will judge for yourself if that's fun for you or not fun for you. I feel like this is the most fun I've ever had in this game. Genuinely, this is the most fun I've ever had in this game. You might have a different taste. Like You might find something else fun. By all means, do that. I will be making a lot of guides based on things I find fun in the game and things some people might find fun in the game. Uh, but yeah, just, just judge for yourself. I will show you exactly what we did, how much fun we had, and yeah, if you like it, just try it out. I feel like it's very much worth it. Oh, Moon! Look, man, I see you! Woohoohoohoo! Yay! Yes, man! Give me the money! Look at that guy. Look at this badass. Wow, what, what are you using, my dude? Can you imagine how much that guy pays on repairs? And for what reason just to flex on us poor people? <laughs> They're responding, boys! They're responding, boys! Let's get their asses! Let's get their asses, man! Let's get their asses! They have no chance! Let's get, let's get their ass, man! Fucking kill them all! No mercy for the sand people! Got more points! <laughs> Let's camp the gate, man. Let's camp the... Oh! <laughs> that was unexpected. Come on, stay here. We can fight. We can fight. We can properly fight. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, no, stay here. Stay here. We can fight. We can fight. We can fight. No, man. No, no, no. Don't run. Don't run. Don't run. Don't, don't, don't pussy out. Don't pussy out. We can fight. We can fight. We can fight. Come on, come on, come on. We can fight, boys. Don't run. Don't be pussies. We, we bullshitters. We're not pussies. We are three huggers. Three huggers unite. Under the banner of the mother forest. Nobody shall shit in our forest beside us. Who the fuck threw that? Who has a snowball ability, man? I want that. <laughs> Why don't I? How do I get that? Sign me up. Hey. Hey, sign me up for the snowball ability. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't, you don't stun the healer. That's not nice. Right, right, right. It's time for me to go back and meet with the group. <laughs> They're on the other side of the canyon. <laughs> oh, no. No. All right. All right. Yay. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they were on the bro that was so scary that was so scary man why am i not typing oh because i'm in combat oh, i guess the game is like, oh, shut up, Mog, just fight. Shut up, you stupid ass. <laughs> fight. 
You're in combat, you remember? But I'm like, no, let me type. What do you mean I'm in combat? No. Oh, look at Moon. Yeah, Moon, do it. Yeah. <laughs> that was badass. GG. Oh, somebody stunned me. I can't get away. Man, this set is actually badass. Fucking G. That was so exciting, man. <laughs> and look at this. I made a fortune. For real, I made a Let me help out the team. <laughs> Bro, I cannot be the only healer. Like, for real. We need more people here. We'll wipe. We'll wipe. Alright, perfect, 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 take Oh shit, game. The enemies came as well. Oh, oh no, no, no. Retreat, boys. Don't fight on the boss. Please, please don't fight on the boss. Please just don't. Please just don't fight on the boss. No, 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 no. That's not good. That's not good. That's not smart. That's not smart. Don't fight on the boss. 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 I mean, I'm trying to keep you alive, but there's no way. Right, right, right. Perfect, 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 perfect. Oh no, I jumped in the middle of them! Oh, that... <laughs> that was a bad, badly timed jump. <laughs> he just pulled us to the... Yeah. Hey, guys. Hug. Hug time. And I cannot stop looking at this guy. No easy escape. This guy over here. He has that new skin and it's so badass. Ooh, this is this is this is tough. We can't have to retreat. Like there's no this is what I told the guys. There's no way we'll be able to fight them on their turn. Because they just keep coming. Like the best thing to do right now is to one retreat or two No fuck it, I want content. <laughs> no fuck it, I'll go back. <laughs> I don't have enough mana, man. I don't have enough energy. Oh, no, no. We'll get pushed to that way. Get some... Ooh. 
Ooh, I don't have any energy, man. I need, I need to get energy uh, pos potions. Was to go lazy grass. Oh no, we dead, we dead, we dead, we dead, we dead. Ooh, Knight Commander! Yes! Let's see. It's come to an end. How much we've made. Let, let's just figure this out. I, I'm really curious. Let me buy all the hearts I can buy. At this moment, I have 52,000 points. So I can buy 17 tree hearts. But I had 3k points before. So I'll just buy 16. Alright. Hear me out. This is amazing. This is amazing. Boys, with 16 hearts, this is your profit. Right now, this is your profit. 800k. Let's say you want to buy consumables and all that sort of stuff. Let me, let me pull up a calculator. So let's say all the costs add up to 100k, which is way too much. But let's just say, let's just say, it's fine. This is what you left off. This is your profit. You do these 30 days, so every day for a month, this is how much you make in one month. Premium is about 850. Let's just say 9,000, uh, wait, no, 8,500. Sorry, I always say it like that. Let's just say it's 9 million. Just, just to, you know, approximate on the bad side. This is your profit per month. So after you pay for your premium, this is what you're left with. This is crazy good. <laughs> like, guys, everybody should do this. Genuinely. Especially newer people. Like, I I'm not necessarily a new player. I I've been playing this game for a while. But this is how I make my silver. Like, nowadays, this is just how I make my silver. And it's awesome. It really works. And it gives you a good amount of silver to just play around with. If you liked today's video, make sure to drop a like as it helps me out a lot. Wanna see more of what I do? Why not subscribe to the channel? But most importantly, if you wanna be part of my videos or just hang out, come join us on streams. We stream every Monday, Wednesday and Friday at 12pm Eastern European Summertime. See you there.